I will show you how to use this warehouse tracking system. This is a free version. Okay, let's start. This database is for tracking your inventory of items. So this is the inventory list. This is our inventory. This is we have inventory quantity 30. So if I change this one to jumper stack out 30, then I will process. So it will make zero. So automatically this one will make a red background. You can also search by name, just type here snaps. Then you can add items here by click this one, add new item. You can add item. So this one no need to type here, just click new automatically it will generate the new barcode. Here we'll type lace. 14 grams this inventory we will put later unit pitch item price 15 serial number this is optional also to one this one then you can select the category by either typing snacks or by double click this one automatically it will store here to type so you can put any any type of item or you can put also any brand then suppliers just select this one you can type names also or just double click this one then save yes now we will go to inventory list now we have another items this one showing zero so that's why red so we can modify this one example you receive stocks from suppliers so just put here stock in just type let's say 100 pieces then process just click this process automatically this one will update and inventory quantity also will update if there is another pallets also, you can enter another 50, then process. Now it's coming 150. See, now we have 150. So let's say you will transfer 50 pieces to your store. So just click this one. Then instead of stuck in, just put here select this one stuck out 50 then process automatically it will update your current inventory save and close now you have 100 let's say another day coming uh, this one another 100 you see to stuck in again from supplier then you see 100 then process now you have inventory 200 then save and close now you have 200 let's say we'll make this one out here 100 so we'll out we'll make uh, stuck out 90 then process automatically it's coming 10 save now we have 0 10 so you can also add category forward or you can modify also here just select this one edit then we delete this one then save so now we have updated you can add new just type category kangos separately then save now we have category and you can add also the supplier here 
again just select this one and you can edit the details here multiple Maria did see now updating so you can add just click new so this is how to use about this is version is free you can use this one freely you can download this database i will attach this one this one is very helpful to tracking your stocks particularly if you are in charge with our warehouse or storage room you can use this one so this is it how to use thank you and god bless